Hello everyone, in this lesson we're going to look at steps to install Windows 11 without a Microsoft account using a local account. In this video I'm going to show you two methods. The first one will work on Windows 11 Home and Windows 11 Pro, while the second method is only meant for Windows 11 Pro. Also this lesson applies to the process of performing a clean installation or when setting up a new computer. So why doing this? Although it is recommended to use a Microsoft account, since it offers the integration with many of the different Microsoft services and file syncing across devices, some of you may still prefer a more traditional experience. Also, setting up a local account during the out-of-box experience allows you to create a more personalized folder name for your profile, since you won't be using the part of your email address. And if you plan to use remote desktop, starting with a local account will help you to avoid issues establishing a connection. Okay, let's dive into the steps, but before, Please subscribe to the channel and click the like button to help YouTube show this video to more people. It doesn't cost anything to you and you will be helping the channel and supporting my work. So after the installation of Windows 11 or while setting up a new computer, at first you're going to have to select your region, then the keyboard layout. You can actually choose a computer name right now and then when you click the next button the computer will restart but for the purpose of this video, we're just going to skip this option. You can always do that later. And then after the initial steps, you're going to arrive to this page. In here, just click the sign in button. And in the past, you were able to just go to the sign in options and choose the offline account, but that's no longer an option as you can see right here. So what is the trick to bypass the Microsoft account during the installation? Well, it is simple. You just need to fail the process to create a Microsoft account. And you can do that in multiple ways. And the easiest way to do that is just to type anything on the sign in box. Let's say admin. And then click next. For password, you can just use anything. For example, one, two, three, four. And then click the sign in button. This will trigger this message, which will also would trigger the second option, which is to create a local account. So if we click next, now we can see that we have the option to create a local account. For this video, I'm just going to use a generic name like admin, and then I'm going to click the next button. And in here, just configure the password that you want to use for the account. Confirm the password. Now you need to configure the security questions, which allows you to reset the password if you get locked out of your account. And that's it. We just created a local account bypassing the requirement for using the Microsoft account. Now just select your privacy settings and there's all there's to it. Although the previous method works in both Windows 11 Pro and home there is a second option but it only applies to windows 11 pro and let me show you how that works so we're going to go through the initial steps so again on this page you can configure the device name but for this video we're just going to skip this option like i said before you can always do that later and here's a trick to bypass the microsoft account while setting up a Windows 11 Pro installation. Instead of choosing the setup for personal use, you want to select the setup for work or school option and then click next. And then on this page, you want to click the sign in options. And on this page, click the domain join instead option. And as you can see now, the setup allows us to continue creating a local account instead of a Microsoft account. I'm just going to use the admin username and then you just need to create a password. Now we need to confirm the password. And now we just need to create a security password to have an option to reset the password in case you get locked out. And that's it. That's how you set up a Windows 11 with a local account. Now, if in the future you decide that you want to use a Microsoft account, you can actually link your account 
with your Windows 11 profile. And to do that, open Start, go to Settings, and then go to Accounts. And in here, go to your Info. And right here, click the Sign In with a Microsoft account instead. And just sign in with the account that you want to use. And that is all there is to it. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.